Hello, everyone. It's one and only AI, AI across here today. We got Brandon Rogers Bryce episode one. Now, y'all got that poor type of flash screen to five likes, so I will react to the next episode once I'm done with this. If y'all want another Brandon Rogers um video or whatever, just request it and I'll get it done. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and like the video. I already know it's gonna be fire. I could have watched it yesterday, but I was like, nah, I'm reacting to so. this. Alright, uh, let's let's go. I don't know why I got subtitles on, so I'm just leaving it on. We're cutting your funding, Bryce. Mm. Mm. I'm sorry, you want to try that again in English? We allotted <laughs> you those funds to build three children's hospitals. Instead, you built ten prisons. They're cheaper, <laughs> and kids just suck. Oh. I'm sorry. But we are cutting your funding. I heard you the first time. I just didn't agree. Oh. Now, unless you have anything positive to say about my looks, I don't see any reason for this to continue. <laughs> we have the charity meeting at 30. You hear that? I goddamn do charity. Yeah, for people with what? Insider info? Mm. Cancer. Cancer. Oh, well, still, you're not getting another cent from my company. Try anything and you'll see me in court. Mm. Donovan, our investor has just crossed a line. Uh oh. What are you doing? Call him off me, you monster! Now, you see, a monster would not tell your wife and kids where your body can be found tonight. Ooh. But because I'm such a caring person, your kids can rest easy knowing their daddy never abandoned them. That's crazy. <laughs> I do have a heart, Mr. Dutton, and it is about as large as your penis. <laughs> oh. oh! Get me cleaned up, Donovan. I want to look like I give a shit at that cancer thing. She's one of the most influential CEOs in all of American history. What? But is she more than just a corporate sex icon? Activate the Beyonce. The internet is absolutely Activate the Beyonce. This woman. There isn't a ticker or a talker who doesn't wish to one day be a Bryce ticker Tank or a talker. Person. And she might not be your president, but she certainly was America's. How's this for a stimulus package, America? <laughs> I sit it on tape. Show the tape. Put it on your website. Oh, you mean eatmyassjoe.org? Stay tuned, poor people. Is that <laughs> this? Not forget that she Did she really do that? A horny terrorist nah, that's cap. That got, nah, I know it. But in the money world. at North Korean pride. And rumor has it, a literal yeah, heart okay. started growing inside that empty void of a chest. Will she retain that evil edge that's gotten her so far? Or will she now start going soft? Right. I'm cutting your funding. I'm sorry? You said you wanted to help us. Well, I didn't think you'd live this long. I'm oh. sorry, you thought we were dying? Look, I don't know how cancer works. Ma'am, we don't have cancer. This is a charity for people born June through July 22nd. Your money goes to the mental health of cancers who are bullied simply for being a crap. Wait, hold on, are you fucking kidding me? I've been dumping cash into this glory hole for how many years? It's been nine months, man. Shut the fuck up. I don't know, nine, nine months, man. <laughs> with the money I'm saving with whatever this is, you people should be happy to know that I'm going to build my 11th prison. 11th? What happened to you in your childhood to make you such a monster? Uh -oh. What happened in your childhood that made you so poor? No, no. Mm. I'm actually asking. Why are you like this? What, you mean good with my money? I started learning frugality the very day I was born. Dang! Uh, the head's too big, ma'am. What do you want me to do about it? We're gonna need to perform a C-section. What's that gonna set me back? Ma'am, you need this. That means expensive. <laughs> Dang! I knew the value in pinching a penny. She was a con artist, you see, and a damn good one. By the time I was 10, she decided it was time you finally grew up. 
today, I'm going to teach you the double diva diversion. The double diva diversion. The double diva diversion, yes. Her mother and her performed it, and now she and I got to. Oh. The maneuver consisted of one person distracting an individual, often by flirting, while the other person robs them blind. Oh, I don't know why she called it the double diva diversion, because it was apparent <laughs> only one of us was allowed to be the diva. She was the beautiful distraction, and I was the petty thief who lived in her shadow. I didn't not hear that. As a means to live. We were just keeping the lights on, that's all. But what I would have given just to be that distraction, just for once, just to have men look at me the way they looked at her. I was willing to get that validation <laughs> from anyone willing to give it to me. Who is that? Just throw it! That's Bobby. He's just... new. I heard he goes to therapy and he doesn't have parents. Hey! Ah, we're not playing for me! Yeah, someone pooped his Valentine's box. So far, no one likes him. In his Valentine's box? Good. It was That's obviously crazy. saved far more not than the Valentine's the validation, box. but. Sometimes I wonder who was saving who that day. Even in that moment, I knew <laughs> I was living Freak, the pinnacle of ten-year-old rom-coms. That is, of course, until my friends showed up and screwed the pooch. Ew, I told you they were friends. Won't you shut up, Melanie? You shut up, you ass-haver. Melanie, you have an ass, too. You would know, pervert. Ew, you're a pervert? What? what? Ooh, gross. We were perfect for each other. And soon he became the only thought that occupied my mouth. Oh, shit, I forgot about this. I can tell you're getting distracted. Right. You're not focusing on that school shit, are you? Of course not, Mother. You know I detest learning about this world. Good, because the world does not look out for girls like you and me. As the bitch droned on, all I could think about was Bobby. Beauty? You're not a great beauty like me. <laughs> what are you going to do when you grow up? you got to use your brains. And the more I thought about him, the more I felt this strange, throbbing feeling inside my little chest. <laughs> In that moment, I knew my heart was his. Huh? Huh? It was the most alarming. Oh, oh you, you actually... Oh, you, you should be dead. For about 20 minutes. Look so good. I guess that's love. No, that's not love. We, we gotta find a doctor and put this back in you. Yeah, on whose dime? And what am I supposed to do? Just come home and say, hey mom, I fell in love with the boy you don't know, and now I ripped my heart out for the motherfucker, and now I need to get it sewn back into my chest immediately before I die. You did what to your new uniform? Did you not hear a word your daughter just said? She needs a hospital. No, Bro. what she needs is to stay away from boys like you. <laughs> I don't have a home. Yeah, or parents. I don't. I have nothing. No, wait, 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 wait. Dang! Wait, they took him to the hospital? Wait, what? So, yeah, she's gonna die. Dramatic. Oh, heart is ripped out. Oh shit, the surgery was a success. Surgery? What the? Oh shit, I've never seen the inside of a real doctor's office before. And you still haven't. I'm technically not a real doctor. Honey, you know Paul from up the street. Up the street? Hey, you be grateful. This little surgery is costing me an H job. He promised a B job. If she lives first. Okay, hold on. How long is this gonna last me? It could last you a lifetime, or that thing could pop tonight. It all depends on your. You're gonna, you're gonna tap stress, the score. Anger, scary movies, anxiety, frustration. To avoid most people. Oh, by the way, I canceled your membership to that little club you're always at. You mean school? Bingo. It's you and me, baby, full time. You mean school? Don't pull any of your bullshit. Hi. Terry. How you cancel a membership at school? Really? We gotta stop meeting. We're gonna drop, drop her out. You're gonna think it's talking me, you little pervo. I'm gonna continue charming old lady long tits over there where you got her purse like a good little girl. So how's the fam family? Still dead. Fantastic. Still dead. I found it was easier to simply shut up and do what I was told. So that's what I did. <gasps> wow, that outfit's amazing. Oh my god, take it off your body. You should be a model. Oh, great. 
Despite her many reassurances that I was the most important part of this operation except for me, I knew I was pretty enough to be the diversion. She just didn't want to be upstaged by her own daughter. Oh my god. I hit my head, I can't see. Fevery wasn't I hit my head, I can't see. We worked out together. I don't see how people will not together. catch them, like just you know. Well, for about five minutes. It's been five minutes. Then right back and <laughs> working off together. Literally. That is until one fateful commercial break. Hey, attention. Shut the fuck up. I didn't say anything, mother. You're going to. Okay. What's portable and mostly cancer breathe your cell phone? This wireless technology. Hey, I'm Sitchell Hornborn, founder of these fucking phones. You got someone to call, but also somewhere to be. Bitch, call now and get yourself a warranty. Or replace the warranty. Damage, ego, inserted for free. Why are you licking all on it? Thank you for calling Call Co Phones. How may I direct you? I would like my phone replaced, please. All right, I just need a name, please. Addison Adderall. I feel like I've heard that name before. Oh. Oh, I know who you are, you filthy fucking con artist. You're Tacky Tammy the Taker. Why did they call me? I heard that. Because of how tacky your disguises are. Those are my normal tacky clothes, disguise. you dick! Brycey! Get me my white pages! You see, nobody pissed off my mother without getting their home address looked up and broken into. Except this victim already knows my face. I'm gonna need you to take the lead on this one. Can you do it? I won't let you down, mother. Mm, good. Hi. Hi, I'm with the Jesus and God Church, wondering if you have a little bit of time to be a little bit safe today. <laughs> Well, that's very kind of you, but I'm actually part of a church, and I don't have any plans on leaving, but thank you very much, though. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Maybe, maybe you'd like to uh, go out sometime. Like on a date? Bruh, I know where you're really gonna fall for that. Not because I was dumb, but because I was panicking. My head was spinning, my heart was racing, and my hand was writing, and all I could get out were three shitty words. <laughs> Here's my number. I don't like you fraternizing with the enemy. Why don't you want me to just be happy, mother? Because I'm your mother, and happiness <coughs> equals distraction. I'm your mother, and happiness equals distraction. And we have a store to rob, bright and early tomorrow Dang. morning, 9 a.m. I'm not distracted, mother. I'm just excited for tomorrow's heist is all. There's a lot of brands at that store that... I'm sorry, did we steal personal photographs from him, Mother? It's a whatever fit in the bag. These Bruh. are personal items, Mother. Now you're just being a bitch. Hey, <laughs> thrusters. Hey, is this the girl that was just at my house? Hey, these shoulders aren't gonna rub themselves. No, I'm sorry, that that, that 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 was just the TV. Don't go in the face! Face is my fortune. I'm sorry if this is a bad time. I can call back later. You no, know, it's a great time. It's always a great time here at the church of wherever I said I was from. How are you doing? Well, uh, not great. Um, someone broke into my house and stole the only photo I had of my old dog. Oh, wow. Oh, no, you... That's terrible. You don't say, well, who would do that? Anyway, it got me thinking about you and, well, the work you do saving others, and... Oh, good, yeah. You know, there's just not that many people like you left in the world, and mm -hmm. I just... Um... Well, you what? I uh, just wanted to take you up on that offer of maybe going out sometime. In my head, I was going, hmm. Hey, I can still hear you being happy in there. <laughs> what are you doing right now? Not you, not I can still I hear you being happy. I'm ready faster in my whole life. And for the first time Why in going out decade, like this? I oh, enjoyed well, you, my you landed. fucking self. You got on his cap. But, alright. What a mess? Uh, yo! I had fun tonight. This is like an old hey. high school mu movie type vibes, right? Hey. I didn't get your name, by the way. Uh oh. I'm Bryce. Bryce. I'm Donovan. Bryce and Donovan. Donovan. Oh. God, something about that name just hits. <laughs> Why are you still sleeping, you lazy bitch? I love your makeup, I have.
ask. Get him. Tell me it's in the store or I'm gonna die. Is she okay? I knew it! You're getting distracted! I'm not getting <laughs> distracted. You met a boy! I have not. Say what you will, I was telling the God's truth because I did not meet a boy. I met a fucking man. Hey, that's that's the way to reverse. Whoa, yo! Hey, yo, hey, yo, hey, yo. She even started bringing me to his place of employment. Welcome to my place of employment. Wow, place of employment. I, I love your place of employment. Darling, you're late. I'm, I'm sorry, sorry. Who is this lovely can of hairspray? This is uh my <laughs> yeah. girlfriend. The hair, the hair is too much for me, bro. Oh, I know. The hair is too much, bro. You keep bringing this bitch around, I might just give you a raise. And that's Not a raise. By ninety percent of the corporate world. <laughs> the thought of making money legitimately never crossed my mind till that moment. Excuse me, what the hell do you think hey, you're hey, doing? Hey, hey. You're too ugly to touch my sister. You know, I ran the numbers and we could be making more money if we went and got jobs. Did you know how shitty it would be to work for someone else? Well, you gotta start somewhere. And who knows? Maybe one day we'll be the ones people answer to, mother. Jobs are for suckers. They never let women run anything. I knew right away that was a lie. Because someone was letting her run that damn mouth. I know where you were going. Mr. Hornborn would like to offer you a promotion today at noon. Congratulations, Donovan. <gasps> well, holy shit, look at you climbing up that ladder. And that yes, ladder sir. became my obsession. Not, uh, the, the. That's how that clap you just. Owners, and that's why we only have two genders. Wow, you're really progressive. <laughs> you know, Donovan, I. I think it's time I gave you something I've been holding on to. Oh, uh oh. Thank you. This is gonna ruin everything. Oh, it's gonna ruin everything. Well, you, you know, this is my way of. You have opened my eyes to a new way of living, a better ah! way of living, of making a, earning a living, and I what just. What the fuck is this? In my head, that was gonna take you longer to open. Did you steal this from my house? Well, worse. I actually was the diversion while that was stolen. You were friends with Tacky Tammy. Eh, where side came out of Tacky Tammy. Wait, so you made all of this is just payback because I wouldn't give your mom a free phone? But it's a result of that, but it's, it's a, a result. result. <laughs> How dare you think my mom is clever enough to pull off a heist that complicated? I fucked you! Yeah, well, I thought I was being fucked by a decent church girl. Church girls don't need to be fucked because they already are. And besides, I don't need church to be decent. I'm doing the decent thing now, aren't I? It broke it. Now, now you broke it. Now, now. What else are you lying about? Oh, don't come making me have to be some kind of liar just because I don't tell the truth. Are you even with the Jesus and God Church? I'm not even with Jesus or God. Uh -huh. Were you ever even with me? Of course I was. I, I am with you, Donovan. I, and you really have taught me a better way of living. I just don't see a future without you in it at this point. This is where you say something, anything. Donovan. He uh, did. Oh, oh, he did, did. Oh, 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 he did, did. Where about he at? Where about he at? Ooh. Still moving? Donovan, hello, my God. Hello. <laughs> dead, dead. Oh my God, you are so dead. You are one of the most dead people I've ever seen. Ah, I'm dead. There's someone over there. No. Hey, right about this. <laughs> point, <laughs> I threw his head and ran. Like, what was I supposed to do? How was I supposed to break this to my mother? Long story short, I hiked all the way back on foot from the bottom of a cliff. A man fell off of who I've been secretly dating behind your back. His head popped off. And while I'm trying not to blame myself for his death, I know the police probably will. You did what to your new shoes? Mother, listen to what I'm saying. This life of crime is getting us Bro, are you kidding me? Water. No! What you did going behind my back got us into hot water. And this life of crime that you so belittle is the only thing we have to go on. And that's the only thing we're ever gonna have. What the fuck? Do you what, officer? That's her. That's the one that called me ugly. 
This is true, ma'am. You're getting arrested for calling someone ugly? Yeah, my daughter. You know what? And you're arresting how me. social media works? This is this is how the law is gonna change. I swear. That's how it's gonna be. If you call somebody ugly, short, too skinny, too fat, it doesn't matter. It's gonna become a law to a point where you get arrested for like two some months now. I swear. And no, not jail, prison. We should have killed all the witnesses, but nobody. But now here I am suffering the consequences of being too nice. Don't let your heart get in your way. Too nice? I think I'm stuck. You stole from people. You want to be a nice. My name is Bryce Tankthrust. It has come to my attention that a position has recently been made available at your company. I believe I have what it takes to fill not just the void in your office, but the one in your heart. I am a woman of solid ethics, and I intend solid to be a ethics. valuable asset to your company through hard work and good judgment. Not it? Oh. Oh, shit, we missed the episode. Go cry. I heard she's bringing a live version of this show <laughs> to these cities. And so are you. You're coming to the fucking show, here, so. <laughs> okay, I ain't gonna lie. This was like a very short movie, like a real short movie. This was good, funny, good. Had some dumb stuff in there. Had some decapitation in there, but it was good. It showed her whole backstory. This was fire. This was fire. This was fire. Actually, I actually enjoyed this. I need an episode two now. <laughs> I don't care how long it take you. I'm gonna just need that episode too. I need it badly, but um, this was really good. I'm surprised how good this actually was. I thought it was gonna be some weird. St well, it was weird. I thought it was gonna be like some other stuff where you just like do some crazy stuff, which I don't know, just just some crazy stuff. But this was good. This was good. However long it took you to make this, hey, take the same time or even longer, cause this was good. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, comment down below what other videos you want me to react to or anything Brandon Rogers made that you want me to react to. Comment down below and I'll try to get those done. Uh, uh, like I said, after this, I'm going to react to Porch Out of Flat Screens episode 11. So, yeah, I'll see you later. Hey, you cross y'all. Peace.